guys as you can see I'm sitting out here on the top of the hill I'm just basically looking where the turkeys roost tonight tomorrow morning Jordan my little six-year-old boy is gonna go out and uh, look if he can get one so I haven't been out here seeing what they actually do so tonight's the first time I've even scouted at all other than I do have cameras out and there's definitely turkeys here so Well guys, we heard a bunch of gobbles and uh, I think one roosted right where we need him, so I guess. Let's hope Jordan can uh, have a good first hunt ever. I mean, he shot a squirrel already and went squirrel hunting a little bit, but uh, this is his first official tag that he bought, so here we go. Wish him luck. Well, you're going to shoot a turkey tomorrow? <laughs> Bedtime. I'll wake you up at about five o'clock in the morning. Good night. Good night. Good morning. <laughs> you ready to go shoot a turkey? Alright, well I'm going to get some of your stuff ready. You wake up a while. Some of them flew off of the roost already, so we had one right above us and we made it in clean. There's just gobblers everywhere, so we're going to sit back and just hope one swings by. I didn't get my decoy out where I wanted it, but... Well guys, they flew off of the roost and uh, we probably had some within 70 yards maybe. There's a lot of hens around here but uh, the thing is, I very rarely ever got some right off the roost here. I gotta wait till they're kind of out, spread up, had their fights and stuff and then catch the one coming back through. So once one fires up again, we'll, we'll see what happens. Yeah, stay tuned. We're just going to sit here and uh, drink our hot chocolate and uh, coffee. Oh, yeah. Alright guys, well it's 9 o'clock and uh, I'm not sure we might uh, 
stick it out for a while yet. We had an awesome morning. Seen a bunch going out in the distance a little bit. They didn't really want to call in, which we didn't call much at all. We're back in the blind and uh, there's a turkey gobbling at a couple hundred yards. Just kind of how I figured once they get out and about and then they start gobbling again and start looking for hens kind of is what I'd say they're doing. So uh, hopefully here this afternoon we can get one to come in. Either way it's beautiful out here so uh, we're going to sit back and relax and call every now and then and see what happens. All right, guys, there's uh, so many birds and animals and everything out here. We're going to grab my phone here and we're going to make a list of everything that we hear and see. For right now, I can hear a nut hatch. I can hear a two different woodpeckers and a turkey gobble and a squirrel walking around over here. Just stuff like that. So we're going to start a list. Stay tuned. Now they're getting paired up. So we have a list of these animals and birds and stuff that we seen and heard so far. And uh, the list got longer than I figured just from uh, writing everything down. But it's so nice out here. And there's a lot of birds out here. You can probably hear some of them even just now. But So the first one we had was a nuthatch, which is a little woodpecker type bird. Then we have the hairy woodpecker, which is just a little black and white spotted bird woodpecker. The eastern Phoebe. And we had a pheasant crowing in the distance. And a crow, of course. We got fox squirrels, gray squirrels, and a red squirrel running around here. I haven't seen a red squirrel back in here yet, but or before this, but he was here. Cardinals, chickadees, juncos, which is a winter bird. There goes another fox squirrel that right past the decoy there. <laughs> downy woodpecker which is uh, a little bit small smaller than the hairy anyway we've seen both but I think yeah I'm pretty sure the one has a red dot on the back and the other one just the male maybe has one a bluebird geese we have some wild geese back here by the pond a butterfly butterfly landed on the decoy <laughs> I tried to get the camera on him but he flew away again Robins, of course. Had the pileated woodpecker back here. There's one or so, a couple probably. But every now and then, when I'm back here hunting, I see them. Then there's a couple little, maybe a pine siskin, or little birds, little warblers and stuff that are just hopping so fast you can hardly decide which one it is. But.
Well guys, we're in a blind that we just made today. Yep, made today. Um, four T-posts and wrapped black plastic around it and piled sticks on it until it was covered that you can't see the plastic. It's actually pretty awesome. Anyway, our problem with the other blind is we just put it out and uh, the turkeys can see me in that blind. I don't know, it's a tide wee with the holes in it that you can see out through and I just don't think they're dark enough. We had a hen at, you know, 10 yards at the decoy and she picked us out and we were still, I mean, I was pretty sure she shouldn't have seen us, but uh, anyway, this is an awesome blind. I'll have to show it to you here, but um, we're uh, sitting here just uh, waiting for the evening. We didn't hunt this morning, so um, the turkeys were around this morning, but uh, we'll see what happens tonight. Stay tuned. Well guys, we're back in the blind for an evening hunt. It's Monday. There's an eclipse today, so we've seen that a little bit. Solar eclipse, that is. And uh, anyway, we got the decoy out. We're here in the homemade blind again. And uh, it's like 4 o'clock or something, so we'll have a couple hours here. They should be roosting, so... Yeah, we got all our black on here. We're about as black as white kids can get. So uh, we're going to um, hope that works and the turkeys don't see us. If we'd want to get any blacker, we'd have to paint our face yet. So, uh, But uh, they were seeing us over in the other blind. We had that hen come in real close. So we'll see. But stay tuned for the night. should be good.
Yep. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, 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 buddy. Now we wait. Now we wait. You got him. See that? See that? Now we can watch him all day long. We're gonna go get him and then we'll uh, see what happens here. What do you think about that? The best thing I ever <laughs> Check out his beard. On the other side. Yeah, right there. Right there. there it is. Tiny. Yeah, not bad for a Jake. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. You just put it right in the middle. Put the leg in the middle. Yep, there you go. Yep. It doesn't have to be perfect. We'll just wrap it around a little bit. There we go. And we have to report it. about 50 yards, that's pretty good. All right, so how old are you? Six. When did you turn six? October? Yep. You got your first turkey all by yourself. Or you handled the gun all by yourself anyway. Didn't even have the tripod because I guess it was sitting on the log there. You could hold it up, but I'm curious how far that thing went up in the air when you shot because no one was really holding the forearm. <laughs> but there was solid opening, so it went up against. Well, we're still chasing turkeys away. We better get out of here. Everything. Well, what do you think about that? <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's probably going on 7, yeah, 7.30. 
We are done. Turkeys are flying up. We can hear them every now and then. But uh, that was your first tag filled. Maybe tomorrow we can get, get another one. <laughs> Could get another tag tomorrow, yeah. huh? We'll see. Anyway, thanks guys for watching. We appreciate it. And uh, man, I think we did pretty good on the videos. We had turkeys and stuff deer and stuff just within five yards of that blind that homemade blind really worked good so we had the turkeys right there but uh anyway i guess probably me next trying to fill one i might take the gun and go hit some public and try and get one that way and then you know come back here and uh go with the bow but we'll see I guess for now I'm just going to have to throw this video together for you guys to watch and uh, yeah it should be good and we'll have memories. We'll have memories in our heads and, and on the camera so yeah thanks for watching. God bless. We'll see you on the next one. What do you think? Pretty good turkey. <laughs> Pretty good turkey. You bet.